Welcome back to 20 Minutes or Less. My name is Elliot Morgan. I'm Joe Beretta. You okay, bud? Got some super sciencey medicine news for you today. They may have found a cure for cocaine addiction. A new vaccine would keep cocaine in the blood and prevent it from accessing brain receptors. The vaccine would build up the immune system and stop people from getting high off of the cocaine. Professor Shankar Balabajalusa says this offers a whole new treatment paradigm for addiction. Oh, well, there goes my evenings. The breakthrough is published in the journal Human Gene Therapy and it's summarized by a bunch of complicated science speak. So we're gonna try and break it down for you. Joe, break it down. Oh, you want me to break this stuff down? Fine, I'll, I'll, I'll break my evening down for you. Uh, I get home, I uh, take a shower, I eat a sandwich. I do not do cocaine, and then I go to bed. That sounds like a perfectly normal evening. Yeah, does it, Elliot? It does? Does it? Well, I don't want to be normal. And also, I don't know if I believe everything these so-called scientists at the so-called Cornell University and Scripps Research Institute when they say cocaine addiction is a major problem affecting all societal and economic classes for which there is no effective therapy. That's the assumption they're gonna go off of. I'd like to see proof that cocaine negatively affects... I'm sorry, what were we talking about? Joe? Elliot? Okay, let's just take a time out here. Are you really addicted to cocaine or are you just pretending to have a cocaine addiction for comedic purposes? Because I would hate to lead people into the assumption that you're under a psychotropic affliction that's somehow affecting your personal life as it would shed a negative light both on our establishment as well as your friends and family and even acquaintances would be jarred by your narcotic revelations. You're not really addicted, right? Fine, no, I'm not addicted to cocaine. Okay. All right? Meth, however. Stop it, Joe. Okay, fine. I'm not, I'm not addicted to anything. I'm a happy, stable, sober person. You happy now? Yeah. You happy I mean, that I'm happy? I guess. I'm fine? Sure, yeah. Thank you for caring about me. Right, you're welcome. The way cocaine works is that it stimulates nerve centers that release dopamine, and dopamine is what makes you feel happy. It makes you feel special. It makes you feel like, you know, you mean something. The vaccine counteracts that by combining a molecule similar to cocaine in the common cold virus and then training the immune system to send out antibodies. These antibodies attach to the cocaine itself and stop it from reaching the brain. The professor also explained this type of vaccine could be used to fight addictions to other things like heroin or nicotine. Right now, this new vaccine is being tested on mice and it will require further testing before it's released to the public. Hey, did you like for one second think that I was addicted to cocaine? No. Not, not even a little bit? Not even like a little you were bit. like, oh, my coworker's addicted to cocaine? No, I was like, oh, I work with my coworker every day. No, He's I a don't, fully functional human being. I don't believe you. You, I, you thought I was on cocaine. No, I knew. I'm such a good actor. I also wrote all of it. So do you think if scientists develop a way for people to not feel the effects of cocaine that will actually stop people from using cocaine? Let us know your thoughts on the matter in the comment section down below. Like, subscribe, and then click annotation if you want to see the five stories of the day or anything that we've ever done at SourceBed. I'm Joe Beretta. I'm Elliot Morgan. Come back to the next video. I'll be on Bath Salts.